It's not really the same. Mm, why? Because there will be nobody to do dishes and take the trash out. Oh! <laughs> can have sex with him, that's for, for, <clears throat> why, what, ah, I'm sorry, um, what? What? Um, have what with whom? I don't know what we're talking about. Yes, you said something about having sex with what? You cannot have sex with, uh, an it's insect or animal or tree or you know mm, that is an experience among many yeah but with a woman it's like a unique right now someone in Paris near, near the door somebody's have hmm, French baked biscuits chocolate bread and a latte. I am not having that experience, but I can still tap into it. <laughs> but any less or sorry because I am not having that experience in this manner or this fashion. Yeah, but sex is like beautiful. Yes, and then what? Well, you do it frequently. And? You don't feel lack. Why should there be any lack? Because it's not there. Lack. If you do something just out of need, out of scarcity, is not the same as if you do out of excitement and joy. Yeah, but you know, you need to embrace that's in excitement. You sex, it's excitement and joy, passion. So it is need, it is lack, and it is enjoyment. What? That is what you said. Repeat it again. You said it is a need that takes away a lack and is enjoyment all at the same time. I guess. Mm. It's all. It's all. Mm -hmm. It is connected, all right, but the combination... It, it can be joyful. Shit is made, makes a slight difference. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Suppose there is no body matching that certain frequency in the surroundings and manifesting them would take such things that are not seem to be completely well necessary for the moment yeah Suppose you would have had to 
leave everything you're doing, jump on a plane and go to another place, another country, somewhere else, and meet someone that you never knew, and reinvent everything from scratch, then having to bring them back to your world and make everything change. Would you do it? Yeah, I would. Hmm. Why are you not doing it? Because I have no stability. Mm, because you have no stability. Yeah. What if you knew that it is the same case in here? What do you mean? Just because somebody knows things doesn't mean that they are where they truly wish to be. Are you talking about yourself? In a way. You asked the question, didn't you? And that would give you why. You are not doing it because you do not have enough stability and perhaps you could have wondered if it is not the same in here. But it is not just a question of stability, it's a question of preference. Things get altered, things get changed, things get replaced, things come, things go. There's there's no compromise. Nothing has to go for anything to come, but many things apply at the same time. Somebody's walking the street, there is fog, it has been raining a couple days before. Someone is at a high speed, somehow didn't check their vehicle, the lights are dim. Or it could be a sunny day, perfect weather, people wary of what they're doing, everything going right. Everybody will have something to complain about sooner or later. That is why there is constant change. Yeah. I just don't see the way right now. Stability is no stability. When you have to have something in order to feel safe, then not having it will always wait on your conscious. But when you satisfy yourself with whatever you have, then there is nothing to be taken away from you because you do not possess anything, to lose anything. And so you conserve your everything. And just the fact that you are... Well, that's the way I want to live. But at the same time you want someone that will make cookies and make you sweet little pastries and rub your back, tell you stories and put you to bed. And kiss me. Mm -hmm. Among many things I didn't say. Yeah. But still you want just to be. Hmm. There is another name for what you want. <laughs>